hi in this video I will show you how to filter an excel sheet date columns I have produced a couple of other videos related to excel date columns so this one is going to be slightly different the difference here is my date column is an optional uh, column so it may have values it may not have the values so how do we filter in this situation using power automate let me show you that okay so first i am using a manual trigger second i'm using the list rows present in a table set the location of my file which is the excel file that is employee.xlx and the table name so remember in power automate for the excel um, sheet operations you need to have a table associated with it okay now remember we can't use the filter query against the date uh, columns and we can't filter using um, the table name is equal to uh, such and such value because the excel stores the date values in numeric actually so when it retrieves using the list rows in a present table that returns as a numeric value so it's so it's not possible to uh, you know to use the filter queries against that unless if you know exactly what that numeric value is so the technique I'm going to show you here is what we need the next step we need to use here is the filter array okay and next use those values this is the collection of the values coming from the previous step action then here um, we need to use uh, the expression so the expression I'm going to use is the standard uh, you know the date uh, the the numeric value to convert to the actual date so we need to use a formula such as add days with this particular date then converting to the integer and the item of the date of birth the date of birth is a column value of my excel sheet remember that's a column value here and then um, the format we want that is dd slash mm slash yyy because I'm going to I'm storing here in that format actually dd slash mm slash yyy so I'm going to filter against 15 10 19 90 that's the value I am after so I got two values here against it so that's the expression is equal to 15 slash 10 slash 1990 so what happens when we do this so let's run this here it is so flow ran but unfortunately it failed because the reason for failure is it says the template language expression int was invoked with a parameter that is not valid so the value cannot be converted to the target type the reason for this is here this value here it's blank it's an optional value so how do we overcome those situation then so let's go back and edit the flow okay so we need to remove this expression and use another another expression with an if if condition so let's go back and see the expression here so I'm checking here if equals that column is blank which is item question mark and date of birth date of birth is the column name from my excel column is blank which is two single quotes with no spaces then I'm going to default that to an old date else I'm going to say add days the formula which we used earlier okay so let's run this flow now here it is so I have got two outputs which is the matched record against those date okay so this is a technique in power automate we can use to retrieve the optional date columns from an excel sheet thank you for watching